Hi guys, here is how you can install Deep Live Cam by Hexider. This is how the live webcam looks like, and this is the original video, and here is the video after face swapping. Now we will be installing this Deep Live Cam by Hexider on our Windows PC, and it can easily swap faces and even run on a live webcam. Now, in order to install this, we will be using Anaconda. For those who do not have Anaconda, simply go to anaconda.com and click on free download. Provide your email address or skip registration and then simply download and install on your computer. Once Anaconda is installed, go to the start menu and type Anaconda. You will then find Anaconda prompt, so open it. The first thing we need to do is create a Python environment. And if you go back to the GitHub page, and here is the whole installation guide. It is recommended to install 3.10 Python, so let's do that. Let's create a Python environment. For that, type conda create double dash name, use any name you want. I will say deep life cam, and then Python is equal to 3.10. So this will create a deep live cam environment with Python 3.10. Yes and enter. So the Python environment has been created. Now let's activate it. For that, simply type conda activate deep live cam. Here is the code. Conda activate deep live cam and enter. So this has been activated and you can see the base name has changed to deep live cam. Now we need to download some files so let's head over to the github page. We will require models to run deep live cam. So download these models, simply click on it. It's about 332 MB and I've already downloaded it. Also download this inswapper. It's about 264 MB and I've already downloaded this one as well. Now we need to download this whole GitHub file. So for that, go to code and download as zip. And I've already downloaded this one as well. So these are the three downloads you will require. Let me head over to my download folder. So these are the files we just downloaded. Now let's open this zip file. And I will extract it to the desktop. Here is the folder, open it. Now in models folder, open it. Now simply copy these two models we downloaded earlier. I'll copy this but you can cut this as well. And paste it here. Make sure to add it inside the models folder. Now go back to deep live cam folder. So copy its URL. And go back to anaconda prompt. Type cd space draw plus v. So we are inside this folder. Now we need to install all the required dependencies to run this application. For that, type pip install -r requirements.txt and enter. So basically, this will install all the required dependencies to run this application. And this might take some time. You might be stuck here for 5 to 8 minutes, so please be a little patient. So this is all done. Now we also need to install FFMPZ. So for that, type conda install FFMPZ and enter. Y and enter. So we have installed everything. Now let's try if the application works or not. For that, type python run.py and enter. So this is the simple application. 
and it is working all fine. Now for some reasons, if this is not working and giving some errors, then go back to the GitHub page, scroll down, and here you might need to install Visual Studio 2022 runtime for Windows. If you do not have it, open this link and simply download this build tools and install it. And if you have NVIDIA graphics, then you will need to install CUDA. Please install this CUDA, go to this link and download it for Windows and install it on your PC. After that, simply run these commands pip uninstall onnx runtime and install this version of onnx runtime with GPU. And while opening the application, instead of using python run.py, you can execute it with CUDA. So this is the code for NVIDIA graphics. We are using Anaconda, so we do not require to create this virtual environment. So we are skipping this. Now everything is done. Let's see how this works. Now this is a simple application. Here is an image and here is a sample video. I download it from pixels and pixels. Click on select the face. So this is the image. Open it and you will see the image here. If you want a preview for the live chat, select the webcam here. I will use the integrated camera and then click on live. So this is how it looks. And this is a live webcam video. It really depends on your PC on how smooth it works. Mine is a little sloppy, it's doing alright. But this is a live webcam and you can see the moments too. So this is a live webcam feature. Let me close this. Now you can also use this app to swap faces on a video. So this is a sample video. Let me open this. So this is a sample video and it's not that smooth. Anyway, let's select the target. And in here, instead of image, choose video. So this face should come here. Use better images and videos. Now simply click on start. Save the output to your location. I will choose desktop, click on save. This will create this temporary folder. And in here you can see processing. This means it's working. You might also see this error, frame processor not found. For us, this app is working all good even with this warning. But if that does not work for you, then we will create another video to get rid of this error. But this worked all fine for us. And this processing can take lots of time depending upon your PC, graphics and more. So the processing is done. You can also see processing to video succeed. So here is the output. Let me open this. So this is the processed video. And this was the original video. Now the video itself was a bit glitchy. But this is how the app works. Let me close this. Or you can click on destroy here. So this is all done. Let me close this. If you want to reopen this app, it is very simple. Open the anaconda prompt. Here is it. And activate the environment. Conda activate deep live cam and enter. So you will see the base change name to deep live cam. Now we need to navigate to the deep live cam folder, type cd and copy the URL and paste it here and enter. Now we are inside the folder. After this, simply run python run.py and if you are using NVIDIA, simply run it with CUDA. Now here is the application and you can use it as you like. We really hope this video was useful to you. Thank you very much.